13 Ongoing Mega Construction Projects in Barbados This is Barbados, a beautiful island with a rich history and culture. But it's also a country that's constantly evolving. In recent years, there has been a boom in construction on the island, with a number of mega projects underway. These projects are transforming Barbados into a modern, dynamic destination. In this video, we'll take a look at some of the most exciting ongoing mega construction projects in Barbados. Number 12. Barbados International Airport Redevelopment The present airport will be totally renovated as part of the $200 million Barbados International Airport Renovation Project. A new terminal, a new runway, and a new parking facility will all be included in the new airport. The renovation will increase the airport's effectiveness and simplify transit to and from Barbados for passengers. Additionally, the capacity of the new terminal will allow for more passengers, which will benefit the tourist sector. Number 11. Barbados Marriott Resort and Spa On Barbados' south coast, a new resort will be constructed as part of the $200 million Barbados Marriott Resort and Spa project. The resort will contain a marina, golf course, spa, and 500 rooms. The resort will increase employment opportunities and the Barbados tourist sector. It will also serve as the island's main draw for tourists. Number 10. Barbados Light Rail System The Barbados Light Rail System is a $500 million project that will build a light rail system in Barbados. The light rail system will connect the capital city of Bridgetown with the airport and other major destinations. The light rail system is being built to improve public transportation in Barbados. The system is expected to reduce traffic congestion and air pollution and to make it easier for people to get around the island. Number 9. Barbados National Stadium Expansion The $50 million Barbados National Stadium Extension Project will increase the stadium seating capacity to 20,000. A new practice facility and a new media center will also be part of the new stadium. With the development, Barbados will be able to host bigger athletic events, which will grow the travel and tourism sector and provide employment. For the neighborhood sports teams, the new practice facility will be a huge advantage. Number 8. Barbados Cricket Academy A new cricket academy will be constructed on the outskirts of Bridgetown as part of the $40 million Barbados Cricket Academy project. The academy will offer training facilities for cricket players of various skill levels as well as housing for international stars. The academy will also contain a research facility that will concentrate on the creation of innovative cricketing methods and tools. An important investment in the sport of cricket in Barbados is the Barbados Cricket Academy. The school will offer local cricket players a top-notch training environment and will also aid in drawing foreign players to Barbados. The institution will likely increase Barbados' tourism economy and aid in employment creation. Number 7. Barbados Port Incorporated Cruise Terminal Expansion The $250 million Barbados Port Incorporated Cruise Port Expansion project will more than double the size of the current terminal. Up to 6,000 people may be accommodated at once in the new terminal, which also has a public park and fresh food and shopping options. More cruise ships will be able to dock in Barbados thanks to the development, which will grow the travel and tourism sector and provide employment. Businesses and entrepreneurs will have additional options thanks to the expanded eating and retail facilities. The public park will be a wonderful location for visitors to unwind and take in the coastal views. Number 6. Barbados Ocean Park A brand new marine park will be constructed on Barbados' south coast as part of the $25 million Barbados Ocean Park project. A dolphin performance, stingray display, and turtle sanctuary will all be featured in the park. A research facility dedicated to the preservation of marine life in the Caribbean will be part of the park. Visitors to Barbados will have access to a range of educational and entertaining options thanks to the innovative initiative known as the Barbados Ocean Park. The park will serve as a great resource for scientific study as well as a means of promoting awareness of the significance of marine conservation. Number 5. Barbados Sustainable Development Center A new facility will be constructed in Barbados as part of the $20 million Barbados Sustainable Development Center project. The center will include a training facility, a convention center, and a library. The facility will also contain a research facility with a new sustainable technology development as its main goal. For Barbados to achieve its goal of becoming a more sustainable nation, the Barbados Sustainable Development Center is an essential undertaking. In addition to offering a venue for discussion and debate on sustainable development, 
The center will offer training and tools to assist organizations and people in implementing sustainable practices. Number 4. Barbados Recycling Plant The Barbados Recycling Plant is a $15 million project that will build a new recycling plant in Barbados. The plant will be able to process 1,000 tons of recyclables per year. The Barbados Recycling Plant is a significant investment in the future of Barbados' environment. The plant will help to reduce the amount of waste that goes to landfills, and it will also help to create jobs. The plant is expected to have a positive impact on the environment and the economy of Barbados. Number 3. Barbados Museum and Historical Society Expansion The $30 million Barbados Museum and Historical Society Expansion project will double the size of the current museum. A new library, a new research center, and a new display space will all be included in the new museum. With the addition, the museum will be able to show more of its collection and have more room for events and educational activities. One of the first museums established in the Caribbean is the Barbados Museum and Historical Society. The museum's collection comprises items dating from the Arawak Indians to the present day, covering every phase of Barbados history. The museum's expansion will enable it to share its collection with more people and advance tourism in Barbados. Number 2. Barbados Coastal Resiliency Project The $100 million Barbados Coastal Resiliency Project will increase Barbados' coastline's resistance to climate change. Seawalls will be built, mangroves will be planted, and wetlands will be restored as part of the project. The project is being carried out in response to the growing hazards brought on by climate change, such as storm surges and sea level rise. For many years to come, the project is anticipated to shield Barbados' shoreline from these dangers. Number 1. Wiston's Fish Market Redevelopment The present fish market will be totally renovated as part of the $100 million Wiston's Fish Market Renovation Project. A new fish processing section, a new food court, and a new roof will all be included in the new market. The renovation will increase the fish market's effectiveness and make it a more desirable location for customers to buy and eat. Additionally, it will support the local economy. So, there you have it. Those are just a few of the exciting mega projects that are currently underway in Barbados. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I encourage you to stay tuned for more updates on these projects in the future. If you're interested in learning more about these projects, be sure to subscribe to my channel and check out my other videos. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below.